We're going to be seeing restaurants and coffee shops opening up next week, but they won't be opening all at once. For places like the Bean Scene Coffee Works, their COVID comeback is being planned slowly and carefully, just like a good cup of coffee. We are going to follow the CDC guidelines um, for when we're allowed to open within a few days, I would say. We're, our plan is to finish our renovation down here uh, and then we're going to move on working on opening our other coffee shops um, right, in so a safe you, manner. You've got the location um, at Landmark, no renovations going on there. You do plan to go back to table service there soon? We will. We will eventually. Um, we will be putting a few of our tables back in, spreading them out, of course, um, and resuming that way. So, I mean, there's a pub just a few doors down from your downtown location that's already planning on opening up on the 19th. But I guess not everybody interprets what messages have come from on high as to what's allowed right and i think i think you just have to you have to stay within the guidelines um and i think you have to do what is comfortable for your business for your staff i think for your space um, some of our shops that are a smaller space we won't be opening seating uh, the headquarters lo headquarters location where we have a ton of space that's where i think we'll focus on having seating allowed because um, we can really spread people out in that location. Um, so I, I think you just kind of have to take your space into consideration and work from there. But even here you were saying you, you could fashion one door for entry, one for exit, space out your tables and get this going as well? Yeah, yeah. Um, that allows to keep people far apart um, and keep everybody sort of in an organized fashion so people don't feel confused as to where to go, where to be. So what do you think is going to happen next week? Are we going to see a lot of restaurants? Sort I don't of? know. I mean, I think there's a lot of restaurants that are chomping up a bit to get back at it because it's been quite a while. I mean, lots of restaurants are struggling financially and, and they need to make those few extra dollars at the end of the month to make their rent this month. So, I mean, I don't, I don't blame people for wanting to go back to work. Um, but at the, at the same time, I think everyone has to do it quite carefully. It sounds like you don't want to be the test case that throws open the doors <laughs> to see what happens. I don't think anybody really does, but I mean, we'll do our best to keep everybody safe and to keep our staff safe and comfortable, really. Well, thank you, Amy. Thanks for talking to us. Yeah, thanks so much. And thank you for watching Kelowna Now.